guys, today we're going to be making a bun and I have started by putting her hair in a ponytail and then we're going to be using our hair donut. If you don't have one of these, you can always cut the end off of a sock and roll it up to create your own. We found this one at Sally Beauty Supply and it was only a few dollars. But I have threaded all of the hair in the ponytail through that and then I'm going to have her tip her head forward slightly and spread this hair in the ponytail around that donut. Okay, now that I have that spread around the donut evenly, I'm taking another elastic and just placing that right over the top of there. Now I'm going to take these ends and just spread them on each side of that donut. And you want to make sure that you have an even amount of hair on each side. If you have more hair on one side or the other, you can just take a little piece and put it over to the other side until you have it about even. Okay, before I start the next part, I'm just going to spray these ends with some water to keep the flyaways down. And then I'm going to grab a small strand from each side near the top and pull it up together into the center. So I'm going to bring this hair right over the bun and then split it into three and begin a French braid. I'm bringing the outside strands over the middle strand and then as I go down, I'm going to be incorporating hair here from the side into the braid. So I just took this left piece over the middle strand. Now I'm grabbing a small strand here from the hair that was left over and I'm braiding that right in. Same thing on this side. I'm just grabbing a small strand here from the side and I'm bringing it in. As you're bringing in this hair from the side, you just want to make sure that you're not bringing in too much because you want enough to last all the way down the bun. Okay, now that I've added in all of that extra hair, I'm going to take these remaining strands and just twist them up and wrap them around the bun. So I'm going to take these two strands that are on the right side of the braid and twist them together. And then just wrap them up and around. And then I'm just going to tuck that in with a bobby pin. And then same thing with this side, I'm just going to twist it and wrap it around the other way. After you have those ends tucked in, you'll probably just want to go around the bun and add a few more bobby pins just to keep it in place. Here's the finished bun. Thanks for watching.